I'm very happy that I was able to get this score, sir. But I feel the real journey is going to start now. Like a lot of people know in their MS general surgery itself, before they start itself, they know. When the decision is made, just join Speed App. Your words and your classes have been very motivational, sir. So I bring in all the wishes and greetings on behalf of all the faculty members of Speed Medical Institute, Dr. Pradeep, for scoring a CML rank of 2 and AML rank of 1 in speciality, super speciality of MCH, cardiothoracic and vascular surgery in any SS session, November 2023. Congratulations to you, doctor. Thank you, sir. Thank you. And uh, I wish to know a b- detailed, brief background about yours from where you started till date. Yes, sir. Uh, uh, I'm from Andhra Pradesh, sir. A town called Ongol, Postal Andhra. I did my MBBS in Padamulla Medical College, Bangalore, sir. And I did my PT general surgery in Christian Medical College, Bangalore. And uh, after that, I worked in some rural hospitals in North India for okay. about a little over four years. Excellent. Why CTVS? Sir, uh, I always had a fascination towards the subject and uh, I don't know, a lot of people have fans, like a lot of people see Rajnikant <laughs> as the ultimate actor. I had my cardiothoracic surgeon, Vinay Chukta, Roy Tangachan, Roy Granamutu, I used to see them and I used to think, wow, <laughs> at another level. <laughs> very, very, very nice, very nice, excellent. So, I mean, the decision was made after MBBS or MS or even before that? Sir, I was always fascinated, even before MBBS, but the decision to take, the conscious decision to do MCH was taken much later in my career. Okay. Uh, after MBBS, I felt I wanted to give something to the community. I wanted to do uh, work in a rural setup and uh, do rural surgery. And I continued on that path for some time, sir. But certain things happened that I could not continue further there. And then I really thought about what MCH I want to do and I could not think of anything else. And can we know what are the methodology of preparation, what all you did, when you started your preparation, how you achieved this rank today? Sir, uh, last November, sir, I just gave the uh, INISS. Around that time, I thought that I want to do MCH and I want to do in a central institute. So I simply gave the uh, INISS. And maybe a few weeks before that, I had just gone through some of the, there was a crash course Arun Kumar sir had taken. So I'd watched some of those videos and they were really good. Uh, but after that, I continued working. Feb, I stopped working. March and April, I studied for the INA exam, which was in April, sir. So, in that one, I was my I, I was not able to get through, sir. My score was around 37 out of 80 for the written test. Uh, that time, I had not studied any general surgery. I was just reading CT, but it was completely new for me. So, after that, uh, May one month, I took to ship and I came back home and I completely left work, sir. After May, I decided that I needed to do general surgery because my general surgery knowledge had passed out almost four years because zero, sir. So I spent two two months, May, uh, June and July, dedicated towards your classes, where I covered all your general surgery classes from concept days, MCQ days, uh, BD and Travestine. And two months, I just did that, sir. Uh, then August, I had a son, sir. So I took two, two weeks off from study just to spend some time with family. After that, I again started for uh, dedicated preparation towards IMA, was going through the IMA uh, modules at Arun Kumar for uh, Then the NEET exam also came. Uh, I didn't focus for NEET exam really, but uh, last one day before, uh, I just went through all the tables of Sabbath and Daily or put that very excellent <laughs> modules for Sabbath and Daily. And then I gave the NEET exam. NEET also, I got okay rank to 317. So for me, and then afterwards, a dedicated coverage towards IMA. Okay. Now, can you tell us what is the percentage of questions that were asked in uh, cardiothoracic superficiality and general surgery? Uh, sir, around the uh, 60%, I would say, sir, for cardiac uh, and the uh, rest would say general surgery. But this time, sir, there was a uh, few questions from statistics, little advanced also there, maybe about five questions were there from statistics. The statistics classes I attended, sir, that was very useful. Uh, but I think few questions were little high level, sir. In fact. Percentage of question. You said yes. 60 for uh, superficiality and 40 for general surgery. And yes, can you elaborate on that? Yes, sir. So uh, the general surgery questions were the same also. So this time, I tell you the general surgery question you could cover after watching speed. So there was nothing. 
the statistics part of it was a little bit complex sir some of the questions about five questions i would say came from statistics it's a big number for uh, ini i would expect that but i watched the statistics class that was taken a specialized class it was one or two questions i was able to answer from there but uh, a few of the other ones i was not able to it was little higher level for me also. and uh, from the cardiac surgery uh, there was a good number of questions from uh, pediatric cardiac surgery few from from the other disease it was most of what arun kumar sir had taught and some based on drugs but uh, there were some questions i feel that uh, you have to work in the specialty to be able to answer them and i don't have that experience but uh, there was no question that came that i didn't know what was happening everything was covered by arun kumar sir and i had something. great now can you tell me number of questions you attended uh-huh. Uh, feeling a little shy to say this, sir, but I have. I think it's seventy-nine or eighty percent. Oh, very good. Why you need to feel shy? You should be proud. <laughs> yeah, uh, about sixty-two questions I gave, sir. First, at first time, first glance, I was able to answer them. Sixty-two at a shot, and I knew that at least ninety-five percent out of them. Okay. The other uh, eighteen questions were there were some doubts, I think, between two options, something like that. But my heart was not letting me let it go. So I gave those also, sir. very good very good so now uh, you are heading towards uh, delhi aims yes sir i hope to go to delhi aims so i want to ask you uh, now from now on you will be proceeding to aims delhi i think your uh, dream branch and the specialty uh, has come true and now uh, the superstar is in making the hero is in making <laughs> dr pradeep he is into the legacy of uh, making into Uh, cardiac surgery and be a king of surgeons and uh, now what is the feel now what do you feel at this point of time uh, what is your uh, feel right now sir i am very happy that i was able to get this score sir but i feel the real journey is going to start now uh, <laughs> i don't know anything about the specialty sir i'm starting from zero you can even say negatives arun kumar sir has given a good base but i'm looking forward to start the course i think i believe it's going to only start my journey is not yet started sir i am excited <laughs> sir and uh, i hope to be see something this, somewhere this cardiac yes, surgery is, a, is very very exciting field uh, yes, see sir. you you take in the patient after you diagnose and you want to manage with surgery then uh, I mean you I mean apart from beating heart surgery for cabgs and rest of all the procedures that you arrest the heart then you do the repair and bring back it and it is it is I mean, kind of if you want to experience the feel of a surgeon the highest end of that is with cardiac surgery there is no doubt about it and it is an exclusive field nobody can uh, come and say i can <laughs> do this i can do that nothing only a person who is trained completely in cardiac surgery uh for years will be able to uh, do an operate and uh, feel is totally different and uh, the work that is done is uh, phenomenally exceptional and uh, definitely you will feel very good about it not only after finishing from day 1 i'm telling you uh, the kind of uh, the joy and the kind of accomplishment as a surgeon will start on day 1 uh, from your chief uh, the, the day you enter into the specialty department Uh, from the chief that the minute you see the chief itself will be thrilling <laughs> and see all the other uh, i mean assistant uh, surgeons associate professors and from your uh, first and second year i mean third, third and second year of uh, the pgs they themselves will look huge and uh, they were in in mind and also the kind of uh, uh, feel that you're going to have i i'm, I'm telling you this is my experience i'm just sharing with you and uh, yes. that even holds good even today also that should <laughs> yes So, what is the message that you want to give to students who are aspiring for MCA super specialty? Uh, I would say once that decision is made towards MCH, you know, like lot of people know in their MS general surgery itself before they start itself, they know I want to do MCH in urology. When the decision is made, just join Speed App. <laughs> you don't need anything else. <laughs> don't need to study books. Nothing. The app is just wonderful. It's a vast resource. If you and uh, I don't think any question can come outside. your classes sir and uh, i also attended the specialty classes by dr basan neurosurgery even those uh, nothing in neat can come outside what you is too extensive sir they cannot give it's not possible <laughs> so moment that decision is made to join for to go for an mch course please join up speed uh, 
and uh, also just uh, choose your specialty wisely a lot of people told me also that a lot of things about cardiac surgery and this that for me it's a passion project sir this is what i want to do it does not they are not going to do it this is for me i am doing it for myself and once you make that decision try and uh, research about colleges see which college that you want to do which institute that you want to do and then start working towards that yes very nice now time to thank whom all you want to thank that they have i mean be behind you till date uh, to achieve what you are today yes sir first i would like to thank god sir <laughs> my the effort is mine but the result is coming from him sir after that i would like to thank you dr arun kumar sir and the speed team sir it is all your efforts and my efforts are there sir but i can really see how much effort you have taken we are speaking for the first time now sir but i watched your videos <laughs> for two months so it feels like i know you very well and your words and your classes have been very motivational sir and special thanks to arun kumar sir without his guidance it is not possible sir cardiac surgery is a different specialty sir different field to it and we have no knowledge about it sir gastro uro you can understand cardiac it's beyond my understanding so without his classes it would not have been possible so i would like to thank the speed team after that i would like to thank my wife and my family sir they have had a son now he's 3 months old i thank her for congratulations to you thank you sir i thank her for giving me the time to study and supporting me in my decision sir great doctor once again i wish you all the very best and all the success and behalf of all the faculty members and team of speed to dr pradeep for achieving such a wonderful uh, rank and uh, success the pinnacle of success and his dream of his choice and dream of specialty and the premium institute of the country and we wholeheartedly wish you all the best for a great career as a cardiac surgeon in years to make and uh, and the special and the superhero uh, is in making and also we wish you and all your family members uh, best wishes and congratulations and convey yes. regards to everybody and all yes. the best to you for a great career thank you thank you very much thank you thank, thank you, you.